so now we are going to learn about relational operators so relational operators is this many the end result is either true or false so when you are going to validate lesser than greater than the end result will give it as a either true or false so how it will be <coughs> if you see that let's take a is equal to 10 b is equal to 20. so if you are going to verify if a is bigger than b or not how you can do you can verify it like if a is bigger than b so the result will be no it not be bigger than it will be a false the similarly a lesser than b so the result is true okay so this kind of operations if you are going to perform you can do by using these operators the relational operators so let's write the program for that how you can do new relational operator example here public static void main i'm going to use two variables a is equal to 10 int b is equal to 20 system dot out dot print ln a is lesser than b okay so you can add some text before that okay it will be easily understandable when you see the result at the time this will help you what the logic you wrote okay so here you put it like this it will work greater than and lesser than or equal to greater than or equal to i have all this lesser than greater than or equal to equal to or not equal to greater than or equal to and not equal to i hope i covered all of them okay one more is left okay so here it's a greater than lesser than or equal to greater than or equal to if you run this program you can see the result as true or false likewise so my result is 10 a value is 10 b value is 20 here we are verifying it as this relational operators the final output is coming it as this way okay so when you are going to validate these kind of things you can use these relational operators